Let's talk crypto. You've heard of Bitcoin. One day it's worth a fortune, the next not so much. That wild price swing or volatility makes crypto exciting for gamblers, but terrible for everyday use. Imagine your groceries costing wildly different amounts every week. Not practical, right? Enter stablecoins, the calm, reliable friend in crypto's chaos. Their job? Stay pegged to real-world money, like the US dollar or British pound. This stability bridges the gap between traditional cash and digital assets. With stablecoins, you get fast, global transactions, minus the heart-stopping price swings. They're designed with systems to keep their value steady, usually by pegging to a major currency. That predictability is what makes stablecoins a game-changer, turning crypto from a gamble into a practical tool. They're the essential plumbing that makes digital finance work for everyone. So, how do stablecoins stay steady? There are three main types. First, fiat-backed stablecoins like USDT and USDC are backed one-to-one -one by real dollars in a bank. Simple, trusted, but you rely on the company's honesty. Next, crypto-backed stablecoins like DII. Here, you lock up more crypto than you borrow as a safety buffer. It's transparent and decentralized, but more complex. Then, algorithmic stablecoins, no assets, just code. Algorithms adjust supply to keep the price stable like a digital central bank. But as we saw with Terra Luna, if the code fails, the whole system can collapse. Each method has trade-offs. Fiat-backed is easy, but centralized. Crypto-backed is open, but complicated. And algorithmic is bold, but risky. Understanding these differences helps you choose the right stablecoin for your needs. The key is knowing how much risk you're willing to take. Stablecoins aren't all created equal. Some are rock solid, others are experiments. The best choice depends on your trust, your tech comfort and your appetite for risk. In the end, stablecoins are all about keeping your digital money steady. They're the anchor in crypto's stormy seas. Pick wisely and you can enjoy the benefits of crypto without the wild ride. That's how stablecoins keep their cool. Stable coins were born from Bitcoin's wild price swings. Great for speculation, bad for daily use. Early traders needed a stable digital asset to move between cryptos without cashing out to banks. Tether, USDT, launched in 2014, was the first big hit. One token, one dollar in reserve. It solved the problem, but raised questions about trust. Was the money really there? This led to crypto-backed coins like DAI, where code, not companies, held the reserves. Then came algorithmic stablecoins, aiming for decentralization without collateral. Some worked, some crashed. The evolution of stablecoins is a search for digital cash that's stable, trustworthy, and ready for the future. Stablecoins are a safe harbor for crypto traders. When markets swing, they protect your funds without leaving the crypto world. In decentralized finance or DeFi, stablecoins are the backbone. You can lend, borrow and earn interest, all without banks. They're also revolutionizing remittances. Sending money abroad is now fast, cheap and nearly instant. Imagine sending $100 to family overseas in minutes with almost no fees. Some businesses are starting to accept stablecoins for payments, thanks to low fees and global reach. As the tech improves, using stablecoins for everyday purchases could become as normal as tapping your card. They make digital money practical for real-world use. Whether you're trading, saving or sending money, stablecoins make it simple. They're the digital cash for a new financial era. That's why stablecoins matter. What's next? Stablecoins are set to power the next wave of digital finance, especially in Web3. They'll be the go-to currency for buying digital art, tipping creators and paying in virtual worlds. Banks are taking notice. Stablecoins could force them to innovate or risk being left behind. Central banks are exploring their own digital currencies, like the digital pound, to keep up. The future will likely mix private stablecoins and government-backed digital cash. Stablecoins solve a real problem and unlock new innovation. Whether issued by companies or countries, they're paving the way for a faster, more global financial system. Watch this space. Stablecoins are just getting started.